so Purim is all about Venahapach, Venahapach, and I would sing more. That would be very entertaining, but not that kind of entertainment. I was once parked in front of a swarm store on 14th Avenue, parked a little bit close to a pump, and I came out and I said, oh, no, 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 there it goes. And I take the ticket, I said, I can't afford this. And I'm saying, okay, Rebbe whatever it is, it is. And in those days, they had to manually write the address, which meant if they made a mistake, you can get away with the ticket if there's no such address. And I look, and the address says 7910 14th Avenue. And I'm saying, well, 7910? This is on 45th Street in Borough Park. It would be 45 something. How did the ticket agent make such a mistake? 7910? So I opened up a phone book, and sure enough, there is no 7910. Last Rosh Hashanah was decided. It would only be a scare, but no financial loss. Thank you, Hashem. And I'm trying to figure out how did the ticket agent make this mistake? How in the world did he think 7910? If 7910 is like 40 blocks away, and somebody pointed out to me that in front of the Swarm store, there's a sign, Cypher. Now, if you don't know that it's Hebrew letters, you think it's numbers. So Cypher looks like 7910. You know, it's a scary world out there. It's really scary. It's really frightening. And the time is going to come. At that moment, right before Mashiach is going to come, we're going to say, Rabbi Nishalayla, what's going to be? We don't understand what's going on. The world can't be more vulnerable. It can't be more lopsided. We're in a slow... Relax. You stand up to your tests. And suddenly the Rabbi will show us, Ah, it's all good. It was all you. What we think is 7910 is really cipher. We have to be willing to make the turn. Lyon, France. The Nazis come in. There's an avar de Kashul. They said to the Rav, we can't go Davin tonight. We heard terrible stories. You heard terrible stories? And if you don't go Davin, you're going to be saved from the terrible stories. So they came to Davin Friday night. A Nazi general walked in and stood behind them. They said, let's run. He said, there's no place to run to. We can run into the hands of the Rabbi Shalem. And the Nazi general took out a hand grenade, picked it up. And his plan was to toss it into the crowd. The last moment, everyone turned toward him. You're going to jump me. I'm here alone. In his panic, he dropped it by mistake. And the only one that exploded then was the one that was going to try to explode someone else. At least for that moment. Why did all the Yidden turn around? Time for Bayi B'Shalim! They turned around and he's holding the grenade, ah! He didn't know why they turned around. V'nahapach, v'nahapach, Hashem says, do me a favor. Let me run the world. You turn around, you don't look, and I'll take care of everything else. Because the biggest fear and the biggest danger will turn into the biggest source of Raha.